In this video today, I'm going to be taking these two ordinary cups of plastic and I'm going to change them into one of the best crappy catching colors you have ever seen. And be sure to stay to the end because I'm going to show you how to win a free sample pack of this color. So let's be honest, I have been talking about this color for, I don't know, three or four months. You know, my buddy Brian K, I'm just going to say that as his name, requested this color about three or four months ago and I've honestly been you know I've, I've made a few runs of it I've changed this changed that but I believe I've got the recipe just down pat and it's ready for production because if you didn't know here at Crappy Man Jigs every color we make we are honestly out there on the water making sure that it will catch fish we're here to catch fish on this channel not catch fishermen so Let's go ahead and get these two cups heated up and I'm going to walk you through the process of how we make the color ghost. So making the color ghost, it honestly starts with the top color. <clears throat> and that's the, the main ingredient of everything is the top color. So, so let's just talk about the, I guess the origin of ghost would be, you know, a color that honestly mimics kind of like a Tennessee shad, but at the same time it mimics pretty much any bait fish in the water. So what I've got added here is what they call a gold highlight powder. So we're gonna mix that in. <clears throat> we really just want a tint of gold. Because we want it to kind of shimmer. Not really sure how good the camera picks that up. So we put a little bit of gold highlight. Now we're gonna add just a little bit of brown. Three, four, five. So we got five drops of brown just to see where we're at. Like I said, I mean, I've been tweaking this for months, and that's why I, I kind of know how much powder and how much liquid I want. And that right there, I mean. I don't know how good y'all can see that, but that is just sexy. So now we're gonna add just a, like one drop of this green pumpkin, like literally one drop. So one drop of green pumpkin. We're also gonna add a drop of let me find it of another brown just to kind of shift away from the, the darkness of it after this green pumpkin is mixed up so now we're going to add just a smidgen of blue medium flake just enough to know it's there you don't want to overpower it we're also going to add just a little bit of chrome. Just like the blue, you want just enough to know it's there, but not enough to overpower the color. So we've got the top color mixed. This is what it's looking like right now. Now we got to mix the bottom. So we'll set that to the side. The bottom's fairly easy. So we've got another one. So the bottom is basically going to be clear. So the gold brown actually pops. If that makes sense. So on the bottom is really simple. We're going to add some chrome to it. Not a lot, like I said just enough to make it noticeable 
So we've got chrome. And we're gonna add just a flake of this hologram. And then we're gonna take some blue highlight and I am literally going to put the smallest smidgen of this. I want just enough for it to glow. Like you can barely even see the amount of blue highlight that went into it. Let's go ahead and mix this up. So as you can see, it's pretty much just clear and sparkly got our two colors mixed up we've got the top brown the bottom silvers not really silver but you know we've got the clear bottom going on here so now gotta do your safety first that is not my glove so now you gotta do safety first get your glove on because this dual injector gets hot we're gonna shoot it with a do it dual injector so we've got bottom, top. Got all our molds set up. Get in and get us some. Gonna shoot the flick first. And we're gonna move over to a minnow. And then we're gonna go to a minnow. 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 Stinker. Stabber. This is why you wear gloves, because you can burn yourself really easy with a dual injector. All right, so I'm not real big on a, a drum roll, but let's do it. That was my world's worst fishing attempt. <laughs> so let's take these apart, see what we're working with. I'm gonna demold the flick first. Get this first one we shot. Ha <laughs> yes. Yes, sir. Check this out. Not sure how good the camera can pick it up, but it is a clear jig, hence the name Ghost. But when it reflects in the light, you get the brown to it. That's what makes it I guess ghost. Let's see what the old little minnow looks like. With the little minnow. So you got the, the clear bottom with a gold reflect brown with the blue flakes on top. The part of the video that you've probably been waiting on, how do you win? See, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna throw in each variety that we just made. So we're gonna have flicks, stinkers, and minnows in the same bag. And we're gonna give away probably five pack of minnows, 10 stinkers, five flicks, 10 stabbers but all of those are going to go in the same bag we're going to give it away to two people so this is how you win you need to share this video on facebook twitter or instagram or anywhere that you have social media you must be subscribed to the channel because i will check if you are subscribed and you must leave a comment down below saying you know 
what you think of the jig or do you think it'll work it's, it is a clear jig but when the light reflects it it's brown so this is a clear water monster you don't want to sleep on this guys and if you don't you know feel like waiting to win the the giveaway or not excuse me head to the website these are up for grabs now be sure to use code turner fishing for 10 percent off your entire order and i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you haven't already hit that red button down below subscribe to the channel join the turner family and i will catch you on the next one